Well, if you haven't heard over the weekend that Mac, the almighty Mac, has a Trojan, <laughs> has a virus. <laughs> well, you know, you know, and, and, and you have to remember, it's still, I mean, we always said that, uh, yeah, Mac, it's not like PC, and, um, and um, it doesn't get that many uh, viruses or, you know, whatever. But the problem is because uh, McIntosh has been working hard making viruses for, for the for the uh, for for Microsoft, and finally Microsoft have figured out how <laughs> to get even <laughs> and to reduce the sales of Mac and new clients. So now people are going to be skeptical, talking about maybe I got a virus. Even uh, Serena William had a virus. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just joking. I don't know. Listen, the, the important part about your about your tool which is your computer or your laptop, so there's always these nitwits who ain't got nothing to do or who are who think it's a joke, who are angry. And a lot of them are people who started up some sort of a business and it didn't work out. <laughs> and, you know, they just wasn't one of the Bill Gates or it wasn't one of the, uh, what's the guy named who, uh, Job. Maybe it wasn't one of, the, the, one of these kind of people. Um, so... You know, people are going to, you, you still have to be, look, the whole idea is this, and I, I'm not, I'm going to try to make this kind of short. What you need to remember is, be careful what you download. And, I mean, I'm putting a little information so you can read about the flashback and all the other stuff. So you can read about how to be a little more selective when it comes to what you download in, into your computer. Just be careful. Like, you know, I mean, I know there's a lot of stuff, but I even for myself, I'm, I'm just, particular, I mean, what I load, and I don't open emails from people that I really don't know, I mean, you know, and, and especially with attachments, so you you just have to be a little careful, I mean, for, for my business, and, and this is what you, I think, would be a better scenario, if you have a business, then you should have a computer that you use specifically for your business, and then you should have a computer that you use for your personal um like, I mean, uh, because the thing is that what, what you do on your personal computer is much different than what you're going to do in your business. And if I get a virus on my business computer, probably somewhere I got my information on a server somewhere backed up so I can easily retrieve it. And I also have to finance and legitimately finance to repair my um, business computer than to try to tell people that it's my personal computer, it's my business computer with all that porno on it. <laughs> I'm just joking. Or all those games, because that's what we're doing. And uh, I was talking to my son today, and he was talking about, like, using a computer. And I said, and every time I see you, you're playing some stick game, you know, killing somebody. And I'm saying, and that's the kind of thing with, um, that's the thing with, with computers. I mean, it's an effective tool if we use it properly. And I, like I said, and also the downloads, you have to be careful what you download, like I said before. I mean, you have to think about what you're downloading and be careful of, of people sending you viruses. All right? So that's it for the Mac. You know, I, and I very seldom do I uh, promote anything without getting compensated, but I'm going to promote this instrument, is that I use Mac. And, I was, and like I said, I went to school for uh, become a multimedia engineer. But I'm a musician and a writer and whatever. But I said, but this is a tool that serves me well when it comes to my photography, my video, and other things. So go to my Facebook and go to my Reverb Nation and I have a lot of other stuff. Go check my sites out. See what I do with my Mac, okay? See you later. Curtis Darby out.